Have you ever wondered how sperm, the tiny cells responsible for human reproduction, are actually made? Let us go on a microscopic journey inside the male body to uncover the science behind sperm production, or as it is called scientifically, spermatogenesis. It all begins inside the testicles, in small coiled tubes called seminiferous tubules. These are like tiny sperm factories. Here, special cells called spermatogonia, which you can think of as sperm stem cells, start the process of becoming mature sperm. Through a process called meiosis, spermatogonia divide and reduce their genetic material by half, because sperm only need 23 chromosomes, not 46. They become spermatocytes, then spermatids, and finally transform into mature sperm cells. This whole process takes about 64 to 74 days, yes, nearly two and a half months to make one batch. A healthy male produces around 1,500 sperm every second. That is over 100 million a day. Once formed, the sperm are not quite ready yet. They move into a structure called the epididymis, where they mature and learn how to swim. This takes another two weeks or so. When the time comes, for example, during ejaculation, millions of sperm travel through the vas deferens, mix with fluids from the prostate and seminal vesicles, and form semen. Then they exit through the urethra, ready to fertilize an egg and potentially create life. So next time you hear someone say, it all starts with a single sperm, you will know just how much science, time, and biology goes into making that one microscopic cell. If you learn something new, hit that like button and share this video with someone curious like you. See you next time.